day today. Guys, today I have in front of me the beautiful limited edition Fenty Beauty holiday palette. So this palette is what I'm going to be talking about today. Um, I will have swatches at the end of the video. If you want to go straight to the swatches, there's a timestamp in the description below. Click it. It'll take you right there. But before we get into those, I'm going to tell you my thoughts on this palette. So if you want to hear more, Keep on watching. So, as I said, this is the Fenty Beauty Galaxy Palette. It is limited edition and it is $59. It has 14 shades in it. And according to the website, it says that they range from sheer glittering top coats to smoky, shimmer drenched hues. So, let me start off by saying that after playing with this and stuff, I absolutely love this palette. I adore it. Every single shade in this palette is a shimmer. Absolutely no matte. So, these are all just very, very glittery. It's like a glitter bomb of majestic shimmer and sparkle and I love that. So if you don't like glitter, obviously I wouldn't even come near this palette. The sheer glittering top coats part makes me think that this is not going to be everybody's cup of tea. Is that how the saying goes? You know, not, not everybody's going to like this palette. <laughs> this has an interesting texture for some of the eyeshadows. This palette might have a learning curve for some of you who are new to this kind of formula. If you don't use a primer, I can can almost guarantee you're not gonna like it. Even with a primer, some of them I feel just need glitter glue for them to have their maximum potential. And this is why I did my swatches a bit different this time. So what I did is that the first swatch is primer only, and then the second swatch is with glitter glue. And with some of them, you can really see a big difference. Now, if I were to do it with absolutely no primer on my arms at all, some of them come off so sheer that like, even if you just barely went like that, the colors would probably fall right off. I have another eyeshadow palette, one of the Urban Decay, the Moon Dust palette. And if you play with that, then you might find that the shades are similar in texture to these right here. So if you're familiar with that, then you might know how to work with these shadows a bit. But guys, like I said, with the glitter glue, these shades are just absolutely incredible and just pack so much glitter and so much shine, so much sparkle, so much beauty. I love it. But there might be some of you who don't want to go that extra step of applying glitter glue onto your lids, and I can understand that, especially for $59. By the way, NYX makes a pretty awesome glitter glue. It's only $5.99. I'll have everything I mentioned down in the description below. Another good tip for using this palette is to use a short, dense shader brush to apply the shadows. Those just tend to pick up pigment and pack on colors a lot better than other brushes do. And also, instead of getting the colors and just like swiping them onto your lids, I find that getting them and patting and packing them onto your lids works much better as well. This palette is probably not what most people would consider for everyday use. This is obviously very sparkly, a whole bunch of really different colors and all that. And so I find that like, pretty much every one of these shades is going to be just really nice and glam and sparkly and stuff. So it is going to bring some attention to your lids. And it does make sense that they would be releasing this palette around the holiday season because I can see this palette being used for some really beautiful sparkly holiday looks. And I find that this palette works best paired with another palette. I don't think this is going to be most people's standalone palette. Like if you're a person who likes just grabbing one palette and creating a look with just one palette, probably not the best choice here. So make sure you keep those things in mind when considering purchasing this palette. It is $59, so like I said, probably won't be for everybody. But if you go into it knowing those things and knowing what you're working with, oh my gosh, I, I'm, you'll probably just absolutely love this palette. The colors are stunning. Stunning guys. I don't know if this lighting that I have accurately captures just how glittery and sparkly and beautiful the colors are. I hope they do. When I did the swatches, I, I dimmed it real low because I found that when I did that, you could see the shine and glitter and all that. I hope that captures it as well as you can see it in person. Because let me tell you, in person versus on screen and all that, it's just so, so pretty. Guys, this packaging right here is everything I have wanted in an eyeshadow packaging. It is just stunning. And even like the packaging of the box here is so beautiful. Like this is actual glitter that has been glued onto the box. So I don't know. 
a million thumbs up for the packaging from me. So anyway guys, those are my thoughts on this palette. I'm absolutely loving it, but I know that, you know, not everybody is going to love this palette. So I hope that some of my tips and tricks and words or whatever might help some of you guys decide whether you really do want to spend the money on this or help you use it a little bit better. If you do have any other questions, feel free to ask and I will try my best to answer for you guys. And I want to know if any of you are considering picking this up. If you have, I want to know what your thoughts are on it. And if you're not, I want to know why. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please thumbs up. Please subscribe if you have not already. And let's get into the swatches. Show no fear. 